بسم الله الرحمن الرحيم الحمد لله رب العالمين وصلى الله وسلم على نبينا محمد وعلى آله وصحبه وسلم أما بعد Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala all throughout the Quran has exhorted us to spend to spend before it's too late spend in the cause of Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala spend fi sabilillah fi sabilihi subhanahu wa ta'ala and in the beginning of surah al-baqarah Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala says alif lam mim dhalika al-kitab la rayba fi hudin lil-muttaqin alladhina yu'minuna bil-ghayb wa yuqimuna as-salat wa mimma razaqnahum yunfiqun Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala says in mimma razaqnahum yunfiqun and from he is speaking about the believers he said in what from what we have provided for them they spend this is the characteristic of the believer that they spend in the cause of Allah and may Allah forgive us all of our shortcomings and bless us to be of those who spend in his cause subhanahu and with that Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala also says in Surah Al-Baqarah, Subhanah, he says, Ya ayyu al-ladheena amanu anfiqu mimma razaqanakum min qabla in yatiya yawmun la bay'an fi wa la khullatun wa la shafa'atun wal kafirun huma zalimun. Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala says in Surah Al-Baqarah as well, he addresses the believer and exhorts the believer. Ya ayu al-ladheena amanu, O you who believe, anfiqu mimma razaqanakum, spend from what we have provided for you. Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala is the provider, He's our razaq. So, when we're in desperation about our rizq, we have to tawakkal ala Allah and realize that the rizq comes from Allah. Our provisions, they come from Allah the Almighty, subhanahu wa ta'ala. يَا أَيُّهَا الَّذِينَ آمَنُوا أَنْفِقُوا مِمَّا رَزَقَنَاكُمْ مِنْ قَبْلِ أَنْ يَأْتِيهُمْ يَوْمٍ لَعَبَيْنَ فِي Before a day comes when there is no, there will be no business transactions. وَلَا خُلَّةٌ وَلَا شَفَاعَةٌ وَالْكَافِرُونَ هُمْ وَظَالِمُونَ And there will, you will have no companions and no one will intercede for you. And the disbelievers, they are the ظَالِمُونَ Those are the wicked oppressors. So on that day, the day of judgment, no one will have anyone who can benefit them and save them from the punishment of Allah. So if we don't do our good deeds, the Salaf used to say, this life is dar, uh, uh, the dunya is dar al-amal. It is the time of the amal. And the akhirah, the hereafter, is dar al jaza It's the time to reap the reward. And we ask Allah the Almighty to accept our good and forgive our evil. Wa sallallahu wa sallam ala nabiyyina Muhammad wa ala alihi wa sahbihi wa sallam.